Welcome back, Pocket Monsters, and we finally got our hands on some Guardians Rising. They were opening a Tapu Koko Elite Trainer Box and four Blister Packs, and oh my goodness. We have the Vicavolt Hollow promo, and we have the Turtonator Hollow promo, and we have two of each. I, ugh, we just can't go wrong. Let's start off by Ninja opening this Elite Trainer Box here, and let's check out the poster that came with it this time around. Let's see. Oh, all the things are moving. Here's the poster with all the featured pack arts. The player's guide tells you about strategies with the cards. It tells, gives you every card in the set. There's a checklist on it as well. And here are all the things we'll be looking for today, mostly in this section here. And of course, right here, down there, and you know, pretty much everything, because there's like 50 bajillion secret rares in this set. And you've also seen Elite Trainer boxes before, but let's check out this Tapu Koko. Sun and Moon Guardians Rising. Box as always, we have the sleeves, we have a code card, feel free to take that, don't know if that's redeemable yet. We have separators, there's the art on the back there, and Sunny Moon Guardians Rising right there. GX marker, burn and poison. Of course we have all the energies, all the energies. Guardians Rising dice, they're in a kind of yellowy, orangish shade now. And eight packs of one of the coolest sets I've seen in a long time, and I am excited to hop into these. Ooh, this got messy. Ninja cleaning? Ninja cleaning. And let's just hop right into this here. I cannot wait to see what's in those blisters, but I've heard good things and bad things about these ETBs here, so we will see. First pack, one, two, three, four, one, two. Same pack trick as Sun and Moon. And guys, what card are you guys most excited for in Guardians Rising? I, I've seen so many packs open with a Chop, Rock Rough, Psychic Energy, I've seen so many packs open, but I have not opened any of my own yet, and I am just too so <laughs> Oh, Toxapex GX for our first pull out of this ETV. Not bad at all, I am happy to see that. So far the pull rates seem all right in my favor here. And we have another Guardians Rising code card here. Not sure when you can redeem that, but feel free to do so when possible. Two, three, four, one, two. Whew, Bell Sprout. Cottony, Alolan Sandshrew, Mudbray, Alolan Geodude, Darkness Energy, Gliscor, Machoke, Altar of the Moon, all right, Gothita, and a Victory Bell, non hollow rare. I know, I know, I'm sorry. Can we continue the streak? Well, I guess that wasn't much of a streak, but still. Here we go. One, two, three, four, one and two. And there are just so many playable cards in the set. I'm not, again, guys, I am not a player of this game. Absolutely love collecting, always will, but I now have a friend who's actually going to be playing for me, so we shall see exactly how well that goes, as it should go very fine. She actually she actually has played, has played before, so this is going to be pretty exciting with all, the, with all the bulk that I have. She's going to make some awesome decks. Cash, you're outside. Oh god, no, 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 no. I am, that is, that is going out of editing, out in editing. Okay, Bellsprout. Pancham, Snow Runt, Chansey, Machop, Fighting Energy, Altar of the Moon, Weeping Bell, Glalie, Minior, and a Swellow non hollow rare. Come on, Tapu Koko. -go. Let's make something awesome happen right now. Take this code here. So, this ETB was pretty generous at the beginning, not too generous at the moment. Well, I mean, the last Sun and Moon set wasn't really too generous in their ETBs either, but. I'm actually pretty nervous opening this set. Alolan Vulpix, okay. The main card I'm obviously looking to pull is in fact an Alolan Ninetales. Full art or hyper rare makes no difference to me. That's a reverse, I think rare, yep, absolutely. And Salazzle, non hollow rare, very cool. Alolan Ninetales on the cover art and I'm thinking guys, this might be a lucky one. We haven't seen one in a while, so we shall see. If not just a hollow. Three, four, one and two. And we have a Patrat. Carvanaugh, Cottony, Bellsprout, Pancham, Water Energy, Whimsicott, Beware, Sligu, Murkrow, and a Garbodor. All right, not hollow rare. There can't only be one GX in this ETB. Come on. Come on. All righty, we'll see what's in this. Two, three, four, one, two. We have an Alolan Sandshrew, Murkrow, Helioptile, Machop, Slowpoke, Steel Energy, Choice Band, hey hey, Tentacruel, Energy Recycler, 
Watchog Reverse, and a Machop. That's a hollow. Actually, you know what? I really like that art. That looks that looks kind of old school. Check that out. And the final pack, please. Come on, this, this has to come with something awesome. I expect more out of this box. And if you guys have bought one of these recently, let me know how you guys have done. I've, I'm curious to know this one because I would like to hear more statistics on this. Pancham, Slowbro, Machoke, Lampant, Barbroach, and an Orticorio non hollow rare. Very cool. The Psychic one is actually pretty playable. Let's just ninja open these. So I'm a doofus and didn't even realize that I didn't have the camera recording, and I managed to pull this Tapu Lele behind this Talo in my second pack here. Uh, sorry about that, but you didn't miss anything in the first pack. Just, you know, hey, this is how it started. And I am sorry about that, guys. I'm just so excited to open this set. I, I've, again, I've seen so many open in front of me, and it's just like being able to actually touch it and actually open in front of me now. It's, it's, it's just a really cool feeling. But, well, I don't know why they keep spoiling it for us like that. Ugh, that's not nice. That's not nice at all. One, two, three. Whoa, they really had a tough time with quality control in this set. Jeez. Look at that. Wow. Those corners are destroyed. Jangwo, we have a Wimpod, Machop, Whalmer, Stuffle, ooh. Fairy Energy, Beware, Whimsicott, Aether Paradise Conservation Area, that's a mouthful. Beldum Reverse and an Oricorio. Hey, Psychic version, very cool. Oh, pray for something awesome, guys. Pray for something awesome. Ooh, having a hard time with these packs. Are they more slick now? Is that a thing? Is that a thing that happened? Actually, you know what? When I went to a pre-release, this uh, Lowland Slant True actually uh, did some work on people, so I'm <laughs> that, that might actually be a pretty fun de deck to make later. Not for me, of course, but for a lot of you out there. If any of you guys are playing with a Lowland Slant True, let me know. Lolan Geodude, Psychic Energy, Hakamo, Whimsicott, Vanillish, Lampent. Ah, why is this? What's going on with the stack? Lampent Reverse and a Rayquaza non holo rare, whose art I actually really enjoy. So far, we're not doing too bad out of these blisters, but let's uh, hope for something a little bit better than this. Put this aside, save that for later. One, two, three, four. One and two. No spoilers for anyone. And we have a Cottony. We have an Alolan Sandshrew. We have a Stuffle, Tentacle, Helioptile, Steel Energy, Malo, Pseudo-Wudo, Hala, we have a Matang Reverse, and a Turtonator non hollow Rare, which I'm hearing is the playable one-ish. No, maybe not. No, I'm guessing that's the GX. It's probably the GX. Promo seems pretty nice too. Alolan Nine Tails, please. I need all of them tails to bring some luck right now. Yeah, there we go. Actually got to save that back. Very cool. Oh, baby. What is going to happen here? Hopefully something amazing. We definitely need it. We have a cast form. Nose pass. Delibird. Rockruff. Salandit. We have water energy. Hala. Aether Paradise Confer Conservation Area. Vanillish. Snowrunt. And a Drompa GX, which I'm also hearing is playable. But look at that art. Oh, man. I actually managed to purchase one of these off Jordan Japan. Um, and it's it uh, uh, an SM2 uh, or plus was it two plus plus two? Well, that set that the, the the Japanese equivalent of this set, but it's still a really cool card. I'm glad to have it. Awesome. There we go. Oh baby, what's gonna happen? Oh man, if this oh, if this is what I hope it is, I'm going to freak out. Alolan Ninetales, please, please. Got a little Chansey, Gathita, Alolan Vulpix, hopefully that's foreshadowing. Lightning Energy, Aether Paradise Conservation Area, Vanillish, Whimsicott, Salazzle Reverse, Rare, and a Alolan Golem. No, ah, that's a, at least that's a hollow, that's cool. What do you guys think of the new Alolan Golem? Let me know down in the comments section below. Now I'm starting to think of booster box is the way to go, or indie packs, cause oh, indie packs have served me well these past few weeks tell you right now you'll be seeing that a little bit later oh no oh goodness what's gonna happen I'm just I'm so nervous to get get something good I, I don't know why I don't know why I'm more excited than anything but still nerve-wracking we have a vanillite we have a murkrow salandit nose pass talo fairy energy malo energy recycler tentacruel beware reverse and a <laughs> mudsdale Hollow rare at least, but oh, they keep they keep teasing me. Hopefully, Lycanroc is feeling us today, because we could use the help. 
You know what would be cool to see? A double colorless energy secret rare. Because I've only seen one of those in person. Oh man. Oh, no spoiler. Okay, well, maybe a spoiler. But here's a code card. Haha. -ha. Should that have made up for it? Hope it does. One, two, three, four, one and two. But even in the green packs, there are so many playable cards that you can find in here. It's really not a problem. It's kind of cool. Cast form, Tentacool, Clefairy, Litwick, Gligar, Steel Energy, Ultra of the Moon. Hey, Machoke. We have a Gliscor, Rock Rock for Reverse, and a Victory Bell, non hollow rare again. Mr. Coco, if you would assist us, please in the pulling of the awesomeness. That would be fantastic. Three, four, one, and two. We have a Trubbish, Machop, Rockruff, Beldum, Whalmer, Water Energy, Alolan Graveler, Fletchinder, Multiswitch, Heliolisk Reverse Rare, and a Lunala non holo Rare, which this art I'm a huge fan of. Oh, now that I actually read these on occasion, it's a, it's a little different. And two more packs to go, please, oh please, the luck needs to be real. I have plenty of white codes, just not enough awesomeness pulled. Here we go. Two, three, four, one, and two. Except that top Lele probably pays for quite a bit of this, which is kind of nice. Bellsprout, Cottony, Alone Sanchru, Mudbray, Alone Geodude, Blinding Energy, Fletchinder, Weeping Bell, Aqua Patch. All right, I hear good things. I hear good things. We have a Machop, Reverse, and a Sharpedo, non hollow rare. And the final pack, please, please, oh please, please let my Guardians Rise ex first experience be decent. Oh, why, why, why must it be like this? Oh well. I guess we'll save all the excitement for next time. Probably gonna open a booster box of this next because that needs to happen in life. Wimpod, Nosepass, Wishy Washy, Slowpoke, Fire Energy, Weeping Bell, Watchog, Glalie, Gotharita, and Talonflame, non hollow rare. Well, so far this is proving to be a pretty difficult set, but we have our Machamp, a Mudsdale Hollow, a Lolan Golem Hollow, Toxapex GX, we have Drampa GX. And we also have a Tapu Lele GX. So I mean, it, I mean, we didn't leave this leave this empty-handed, not completely. Look, guys, I'm sorry for the long break. The fact is, it's just been a little bit tough. I hope I haven't disappointed you guys too much. Be sure to check out Pokex, who's responsible for the 3D intro, and of course, check out Mouse Alchemist, who's responsible for all my thumbnails, and of course, this outro that she put together for me. She is commissionable for thumbnails. Both of their links will be down in the description below, so feel free to go check them out. If you like what's going on here, hit that like button. If you'd like to stay updated to the channel, hit that subscribe button to your left there, right over Mewtwo's hand. If you want to check out some older videos, feel free to go to the right here. As you can see, there are two. But as always, everyone, I am Poke Clutch. Thank you so much for stopping by. Thank you for staying the amazing people you are whether you subscribe or not most of all keep it clutch i'll see you next time